look at DJ LeMay, who, who will enter his fifth season with the Yankees in 2023. He was terrific in the first two, finishing top four in American League MVP voting both times, but his offense has dropped off in some crucial areas over the last couple of years, although he did win his fourth career gold glove this past season. So, as you know what's going on with DJ LeMahieu, a toe injury, a broken bone in his right toe that also has a carryover effect to his second toe, and that's a ligament issue. And Flash, they're still trying to figure this out. And does he get surgery? Does he not? And how does it impact him? Well, it's got to be incredibly frustrating for DJ LeMayu because, you know, when you have an injury at the end of the year, there's always that evaluation. How can we get this better? Do we do surgery? You rehab during the winter. You're good to go in spring training. Everything we're hearing, everything that we're reading, it's still up in the air, whether this is going to heal on its own. Maybe he's going to have surgery. If he has surgery, then it might be another 12 weeks after that. So think about the fact, Jack, that he's trying to get ready for another big league season, but he can't be training the way that he's always trained to be ready for the first day of spring training. I think he's got to be frustrated, and the Yankees probably not sure what they have right now. Right. If you're looking ahead to 2023 and you're Brian Cashman and you want to know what your roster is going to be, to me right now, LeMahieu is a question mark, and we don't know when that question mark will be around. Race. As you said, we're waiting to see if he might have surgery. If he does have the surgery, there's a recuperation period. Both the New York Post and the Athletic did articles in which they quoted orthopedic surgeons. They're not working on LeMayhew, but they're familiar with the fracture that he has. And they talked about trying to stabilize his foot and how this is just a very tricky injury that he has. Hal Steinbrenner has spoken about it as well. So I think with LeMayhew, it's just waiting. It's a waiting period to see if perhaps he can overcome this without surgery. And if he does, can he come back and be the hitter that he previously was?